Hey everyone! Um, today we are going to do a spread that is easy for when you want something pretty but you don't have a lot of time and you don't want to put a whole lot of thought into it. <laughs> so I've been really behind in my memory planner. I'm going to do a flip through of it as soon as I'm done um, filling it all in. As you can see this is June 17 to 23 so I'm still behind. Uh, we just did or my previous video was this one, which was the July sticker hunt. So fun. Um, if you haven't seen that video, check it out. And it explains what the sticker hunt is. But I wanted to do this video because I've been meaning to just, I'm like, you know what, just decorate the page and get it over with and get caught up. Um, but I thought it would be kind of helpful for you guys if I did a sort of a, a video showing what to do when you're short on time, but you still want a pretty planner. This is just like a, a very easy go-to spread idea. First, you're going to pick some washi that matches what you're going to do. But I'm going to start out just by putting the washi on the lines. Um, and I just kind of line it up to that top one there. I don't have dates on this one because this is an old planner that I am redating because um, I had it and why not use it? So I'm going to do like that. And I'm not quite sure if I, I could just, you know what, to keep it easier, you would just do the same color in the middle. You know, this is not going to be a, um, like, super wow spread. It's just going to be a cute spread for when you want to hurry up and decorate. So you can write in your planner. Because I don't know why we can't write in here when we haven't decorated. And the next one I'm going to do is also going to have to be a really simple one because I don't want to make it complicated. So the main thing is you're going to find some flowers that you like. And I like these. And you're going to start just peel peel the, the flowers off the page. You're going to cut them in half, and I guess I should have cleaned my scissors first. Hold on, let me clean my scissors and I'll be right back. Okay, so you're going to take it, you're going to try and find a good spot. I'm going to go right here because I've got green on this side and green on this side. Am I holding my scissors wrong? I am. Okay, so I'm just going to cut it right in half, right there. Whoop. And then I'm going to put one here. And then let's put one down here. Try to keep it in the in the square. Oh, that one had a hair stuck to it. Ah, and I'm crooked. Okay. There. Okay. So you're gonna start like that. Grab another one. Try to cut it in a spot where you'll get most of the colors on both like that and we're gonna put it here and just line it up under the washi like that and I'm gonna put this one here and you don't necessarily have to do like you know one there one there you can um, let's see let's do this one you can do it you know differently let's do like that and that one's a little long for there, so I'm going to go, let's put this one up here, like this. I kind of want it to go all the way to the edge, so like that. And then this one, let's put this one here, all the way to the edge, like that. And then, let's see, we've got this small one, so this one will be good for here. Whoa. Let's cut it in half, and then let's place it right in there. Whoop. And it's easier if you just turn the page a little bit. You can line it up better. All right, this is supposed to be quick and easy, and it is. <laughs> so let's do that one there. Let's put this one here, just like that. Okay, and let's do... Which other one? This one's pretty. It's long. Let's try to get everybody in there, all the colors. Just like that. This is a good, like, um, beginner spread, you know? Very simple. Cut your flowers in half and place them along the top and the bottom. And this works with pretty much any of the flowers. You just find the flowers that you like. 
find some washi that you like. Let's see. For this spot, let's try. Let's see if this one will work. Let's see. That one. It kind of works. Kind of doesn't, right? It, I feel like it kind of needs more. Let's see. Oh, those are paper. All right. Let's just try it and see what it what it looks like. Or maybe even this one. Let me see this one. Does that one work there? It kind of works. Okay, let's try that one, and then we can add something, a smaller one, to the other side. So I'm going to do like this. And let's see. And honestly, I could have whited out the things, but this the whole point is to make this quick and um, pretty so that you can get started. Um, decorating. I think I cut that wrong. It's like curved. Let's try that again. Let's put it there. It's still kind of like curved in the middle. That's okay. There. And then this one is here. I'm going to put it right along the bottom. Okay. And then I know there was a page that had a smaller one, so I'm going to try and put something over there in that corner that isn't too big. We could even do, do they have any of the leaves by themselves? No, huh? Let's try this. I'm going to cut that leaf off like that. This leaf can just go right there. And this. Let's do like this. I'm going to go like this, and I'm going to go like this. I don't think that was a 90 degree angle. Try to do like a 90 degree angle there, just to kind of whoop, make sure that corner has a little something in it. There we go. All right, so we've got a little set of flowers, and then I thought about using these because it's kind of got the same colors in it. So you could use these or Oh, you see, it kind of goes, why would it do that? I guess because it's for a monthly. That bugs me that it goes further. Do I like that idea, or do we want to do the green washi going across? Hmm. I kind of like this. That's okay. We'll just cut it. Or we can just put it right over it too, right? Let's see. Keep it quick and simple. Yes. All right, I'm just gonna cover right over it. Nope, this way. It's pretty because it's got all the colors. I will cut that little piece off. So let's do this one. So it's flowers cut in half, washy across the black lines just like this how many of you are doing the sticker hunt I think they're fun if you didn't watch my last video sticker hunt basically is there's a list of stickers that you have to find very specific and you put them on each day of your you can do it on your monthly or you can do it, um, you could do it on your, on your, just your regular pages, you know? And my mom, she came up with a cute idea and she did a daily page for each prompt. So if the prompt was like sunglasses, she would do a daily page all about sunglasses with a bunch of stickers about sunglasses, which I thought was very cute, great idea. All right. That's that one. Oh. Maybe my next one I'll do one. I don't know. I shouldn't say it because then if I don't do it, <laughs> I kind of want to do one where it's just marker. But I like stickers, so I probably won't do it. Let's go this way. See, that's very cute. Very cute and very simple. And if, if I had used a washi for the middle, this would be going a lot faster. But I just wanted something colorful 
and cute and fairly simple so that I can get caught up and not feel so rushed and being behind in my planning. And this one's really just my memory planner where I put down, you know, like what we've been doing and stuff. So you see, it's kind of what we did. Okay. All right. I like that. And then we need some dates. I need to cut these little things off here. Let's do that. Let's cut the little, the little extra pieces here. And that's better than having to cut all of them. I just kind of went over the other ones. One, two. That's much faster. Three, four. Okay. I'm going to keep it simple up here. I'm not going to put any kind of special, um, special, whatchamacallit. Oh, I can't speak. <gasps> special days of the week. So this is basically, basically going to be like this. Just use the black. 17. Oh, and I did want to put one more thing in there too. 18. And we got to decorate the sidebar a little bit. Whoa. 19. And I thought about using the, these colored ones, but I don't know. I thought maybe some of them didn't match. Let's see. It would be green, blue, pink. This actually probably would have matched, huh? I think it would have matched better. Let me try. Let me try the 21 and see what I think. Oh, all the 21s are yellow. That might actually look better, huh? I think it will. 21. Uh, the only thing is we've got this red 22. And there is no red. Oh, there is a red. Okay. It, there is a red. Let's do the colors. Why not? 22. I think that's more fun anyway. Instead of that black. 23. So let's take these off. 20. I'm just going to stick them on here randomly. 19. And I know I pulled up some of the white out, but that's okay. Whoa. 18. I thought that black was looking just a little too black. So let's just do these. Don't mess up. There. There we go. Okay, so it was 17, which is cute in the green because it matches the, um, the washi really good. 17, 18. 19. Okay. Oh, nope. I need a 20. 19 and 20. That looks better. I like that. That's cute. Okay. And then I wanted to add, was it here? No, not here. I wanted to add a few of these little bullet points in here. That'd be cute if it's like yellow, green, and I'm going to pause it because I'm going to show you what I'm doing here. Green. And let's use the blue. Like that. Okay. I'm going to do that all the way across and I'll be right back. Okay. So there's yellow, green, blue. It's looking very cute. Let's decorate the side. I think I'm going to go back to this one. And this is the I Love Stickers from Happy Planner. I really don't know if this is still available or not. Um, so let's pick... I like to have like something at the top that says something cute. Let's see, one of these. I love my planner. That's if we were using black. Um, oh, what fun. That's cute. All right, that one's a contender. Oh, what fun. It's got this, all the colors that we need. This is other stuff. I like that one. Or, oh, happy day. I think I like the, the other one better. I think happy, be happy. Okay. So I think, let's just use the Oh What Fun, why not? It's got around the same colors. I'm gonna place it right there under, oh, I should have lined it up better. I try to line it up with the dots just so it's easier. I'll just line it up with that. Oh, it's still crooked, come on. And I'm not sure if I've got letters in this one or not. I could make June a little more colorful. Here we go. Oh, what fun. And then I'm going to add a couple boxes in case if there's like something specific we need to do that week. Where are the boxes? I just want like a plain box. Hmm. Oh, that's right. You know what I was thinking of doing? 
I was going to use these, but I ended up using those instead. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, here we go. All right, so we've got these. We can do, oh, we could do the yellow, green, blue, right? That way it matches that. Let's do it. Let's do yellow. And then the green. Is it that green and that green the same? It looks the same, right? Yes, yeah, the same. Yellow, green, and blue. Is that the right blue? I think that's the right blue. Yellow, green, blue. And we can even put the little dots on it. That way they match. Let's do that. Here they are. So it's yellow. Green. And then the blue. There we go. That looks cute. And we can even add, let's add, I think I want to do another little flower over here. Let's do that. Okay. Let's do a flower. Um, which one do I like the best? This one was pretty. Actually, this one kind of looks like it's going up, you know. So we could do like this. Where's my thing? And these just look better, I think, when you kind of scrape them. All right. Let's scrape some of these. Okay. And then I want something cute here. And it can kind of match this. Let's see if they've got work hard and be nice to people. Current mood happy. I like that. Perfect. And that's going to go right there. All right, and we're done. And look how cute that is. And basically you can follow this um, this model for you know any spread. You just get, when you have flowers, a little washi at the top and the bottom, you can even use the same washi in the middle, cut the flowers in half and have them kind of mirror each other, and then just do something fun on the side. I could you know go and find some letters and I probably will, um, but I'll just leave that for, um, for the pictures. So when you go look at the pictures, you can see if I added. Um, some you know something new there for june but there we go very simple easy spread looks super cute it'll be fun to fill in and it takes you know very little time all right well i hope you enjoyed the video um please subscribe please like the video and leave me some comments let me know what you thought blah 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 okay bye